Well, as expected today, Bill 24, an act to support gay straight alliances, passed easily in the Alberta legislature by a vote of 42 to 23. And every NDP member who voted voted in favor of the bill, and every member of the United Conservative Party who voted voted against the bill. No big surprise there. The question now becomes, what will the UCP do about this? Because it really did fight tooth and nail against this bill. And the crux of this bill is that t teachers will not be allowed. They'll be barred from telling parents of students that their children has joined a GSA without that child's consent. And the UCP said, this is overreach. This is um, stomping on parental rights. Well, what's going to happen? Well, actually nothing. The UCP wants this bill basically in the rearview mirror as they move forward onto other issues. The UCP knows it's in danger of being painted as too socially conservative, and the NDP is more than happy to paint them too socially conservative. So they want to move on to other issues, specifically the deficit, the debt, the economy. They want to make headway against the government on these fiscal issues. The UCP does not want to keep on fighting socially conservative issues. So we asked actually Jason Nixon today, the House leader of the UCP, if his party became government, would he repeal Bill 24? He said that was hypothetical. He wants to move on to other issues. The thing is, a year from now, a year and a half from now, as we head into the next provincial election, the UCP will not want to refight the, the battle over Bill 24. It wants to move on to other issues that it feels will speak to more middle-of-the-road Albertans. I'm Graham Thompson with the Edmonton Journal.